All right, welcome back to Life is Strange, part three? Part three, chapter two. We last left off. Um, pretty heavy shit I'm happened. I'm not big on speeches. So it speak for itself, then, I I've guess. I've always believed that the role of the bartender is to shut up and listen. And by that measure... Gabe was the worst bartender I've ever known. I never issued a speeding ticket to someone on a bicycle before until he came along. He cared so much about my admissions essay. Even though he probably couldn't spell admissions <laughs> or essay. He booked my band to play the lantern all the way from Seattle to pretty much right where I'm standing. <laughs> I can recall 14 specific instances where Gabe said something that made me laugh. <laughs> the first was two years ago. So, Long story short, instead of a ticket, I ended up buying him a beer. Gabe stood like three feet away, grinning like a doofus at us. I'm sure there were more people, but I only remember him. And then he said, I know, that's why the K is silent. <laughs> uh, then the fifth time. Oh, damn it. He cared about everyone. He was the kind of guy you wanted to be around. He was a world-class bullshitter. He was my best friend. All I want to say about Gabe is he came into this bar as a stranger, but he left it as family. Guess that's that then. What happened to Gabe was a senseless, tragic accident. And I just wish it that- It wasn't an accident. Son, now is not the time. Gabe called the mine. I gave him my sat phone to be sure he could get through. They fucked up. And now, now Gabe's dead. That was my shift. Motherfucker. If anyone had called, it would have gone through me. Nobody called. You're lying. <laughs> In front of Gabe's own fucking sister, Alex heard the whole thing. He's right, he did call. He's right. I was there when Gabe made the call. He called, didn't he? I'd like to hear what you have to say about that, Mac. I'm not saying anything. Just, I didn't get a call. Draw your own conclusions. All right, folks. This is an ongoing investigation. How about that... we review the sequence of events, hmm? Well, son. When I saw you at the record store, you seemed pretty eager to find Gabe. Remember why? Hmm? Another fight with... Riley, maybe? No, I don't have to take this. Just saying, pretty wild that you come stumbling out of Gabe's apartment with your face all fucked up. Right. And just a couple hours later, you just so happened to miss the call that would have saved his life. Look, I told you there was no call uh, to uh, miss. I'm sorry, this is awkward of a call. Hello? 
What? All right. No. I'm... No, she should be fine. I'm recording right now. All right, bye. Sorry. Hey, maybe the call got dropped. Oh shit! I mean, it's not like it's not like Gabe was Mr. Reliable all the time. You watch your mouth, Mac. Ryan, that's enough. Now I'm just as eager as you to understand all this, son. But there was a time. Bullshit, and Dad. This little weasel's calling Gabe a liar at his own fucking wake. No, I am just telling you, Mac. I swear, if you say there was no call one more fucking time. Stop it! Stop it now! This is not the time or place. We're all here for Gabe. Okay, Ryan? Sure, I'm... I'm sorry. It's not... I'm just... Damn. Feelings happen all the time. Feelings like this. Can't blame, can't blame Ryan. I'm not the one who killed him. <laughs> Aren't you though? What the fuck did you just say? Ryan, back off. Oh, I'm hell. just saying. I thought I heard that you Mac, were the one. You shut the hell up. No, no, go ahead. You got something to say, Mac? Let's fucking hear Come it. Come on guys, don't make me intervene. All right, fine. As long as we're tossing around accusations, way I hear it, you're the guy who cut the rope. Fuck, that is so... Oh my god! I need water. I need a water after that shit. Wake's over. Everyone, out! Poor fucking Alex, dude. Alex? Hey. Fuck those guys. Yeah. Are you okay? For now. For now. Mm. We'll see how long that lasts. It's not your job to keep it together. Thanks. Do you... Um... It's messy, but... Do you want to come in? Sure. Damn, this is heavy. <laughs> I didn't know I wanted to get to the end of this middle of this episode. Bare beginning like this. Heavy as shit. You play guitar? It was a gift, used to. It was a gift. Sort of. It was a gift. From Gabe. Cool. Fucking awkward. Fucking awkward. Anyway, my brother's dead, so that's cool. <laughs> like, seriously, it's... I don't, I don't know, people, dude. Gabe would try to pop wheelies outside the record store to make me laugh. Never worked. Till he wiped out. That was hilarious. Hey, fool's ball or foos 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 ball. Excuse me. Gabe really wanted to do the LARP for Ethan. But by the end of it, he was more jazzed about it than anybody. Wish I could have seen it. Fuck! God damn! This is so awkward. Right after someone dies, it's like you can't have conversations like this after someone dies. It's so awkward. 
Look, I don't know what to say. He's dead. It's sad. It's horrible. We took this a year ago. We... No way. I can't. What? What? He actually kept it. The tears look a lot more Dick. realer. Sorry. I just need a minute. Yeah, uh, no problem. Calm down, Alex. You're fine. You're fine. Whatever that bottle made her think of, it really messed her up. I wonder if I could help her the same way I helped Ethan. Possibly. Time to use your powers. I need to feel her sadness to figure out how to help her. That's such a, this is actually quite an interesting power to have, feeling someone else's emotions. So why are we looking around here? We now might as I can find out what's really going on with Steph. You fuck your brother. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting your new foosball champion, Gabe Chen. Oh, you're the worst. I can't believe I have to stay in this stupid town. I think we both know you could have beat me if you really wanted to. So you're welcome. Bullshit. Hmm. So she really wanted to leave. What are they called again? Don't shit on my yard! They're amazing! What? Their guitarist has one arm. Badass. That's a terrible name. Don't shit on my yard? Dude, give it up. I already booked a bus ticket. Wait, wait, hear me out. One more game. If I win, you have to stay. If you win, I'll cover the ticket. You just lost 50 bucks. So she basically convinced him, no, he basically convinced her to stay in town. Damn it, fucking overpowered blue meteor. Aww, <laughs> is your controller broken too? We're playing until I win. Then I'll be crashing here tonight. Steph? Sorry. This is so embarrassing. I just need some time. Yeah, I guess she's not ready yet. Okay. Here's to your new job at the station. Oh, didn't I tell you? I'm not taking it. I move to Denver next week. You what? I think I know enough to help her now. What the I just need one more thing. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. Listen, my brother. I actually want this power. Still it's quite can't interesting. Can't believe he's gone. Yep. He's the whole reason I'm still. I'm sorry, Alex. Don't mind me. I could put on a record. If you like. Nah, not really in the mood. Damn it. Maybe something else. Mm, Who's ball? Alcoholism is not the way to go, but. Can I get you a drink or anything? No, thanks. I appreciate the offer, though. God damn it! That wasn't right. I hate depressed. I hate trying to help someone who's always really depressed. I, I, I always can't do it. The foosball was the right answer. Match. Okay.
Did Gabe tell you we played? Had a hunch. I just had a hunch. Yeah? Well, you're right. I don't really think it's a great time. It's a perfect fucking time. Fine. First to five points? If you say so. How do you... Okay, how do you fucking... So, how often did you and Gabe play? Ooh, bitch. It was one of our favorite games. Did she get me? You must be pretty good then. Oh. Mm-hmm. Fuck you. Oh, I'm the- I'm the blue one. You were in a band, right? Right? Yeah. What'd you play? Drums. Fuck you, bitch. How, uh, how long did you play with them? <sighs> bitch! Too long. Fuck gotcha. you. No, 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 no. Motherfucker, this is tough as hell to play. Who the hell plays foosball on a goddamn fucking... Bitch, you thought, you really thought you could get away with... Bitch. Oh my god. Who plays foosball on a fucking PlayStation 5? Bitch, you really thought, you really thought you was gonna get the, the, the fucking bitch got your ass. Five points. That's game. Yep. Big shocker. Oh, hey, at least you played your best. I mean, that obviously wasn't my best. No, I get it. I mean, this is a tough game. It requires skill, timing, and the will to be a champion. Oh, is that how it is? Okay, okay. Joking aside, playing this stupid game with you is exactly what I need right now. Come on, smile. You're on. Bitch, please. You ain't gonna to win. Look at this shit. 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 I'm actually trying this time, so you better focus. Fuck you. I am focusing. Good. Bitch. Wouldn't want you to get distracted or anything. Certainly not. Fuck you. Greatest Northwest band of all Bitch. <laughs> Are you trying to distract me? Fuck! Well, of course not. I'm really just button mashing. Ooh. Slater Ooh. Kenny, Ooh. if you were wondering. Oh my fucking god, I don't know. Alright. Okay. Come on. Bitch. Come on. Come on. Hit the fucking ball! It's you. How the fuck? Bitch. Bitch. Oh my god. Oh my god. Fuck you. Ooh! Fuck you in the set you're clean, bitch! Eat a dick. Eat a dick! Eat a dick! Eat a dick! I just realized that we are mourning over her dead fucking brother and I am in a competitive foosball match right now. Bitch. Oh, oh my God. Why was that so tough? Shit. Oh, that's a win. I was actually trying that time. <laughs> okay, whoa, wait. Let's get serious. One more game, winner takes title of ultimate foosball champion. I don't know. Come on. You know, Gabe would be all about us playing like this. Well, then it's settled. She might win this round, fuck. All right, bitch. This is it for all the marbles. Fuck. So many marbles. Definitely the kind of game you want to focus on. Fucking shit. No matter what happens. Totally. Fuck me. It's like I'm playing on a fucking Wii controller. Hey, so are you into girls or what? What the? 
Um, yep. Fuck you! Yeah. Girls are pretty rad, right? Especially girls that play foosball and host radio stations and wear beanies. Like it's a religion. That's kind of cute. <laughs> Sounds like a winning combo. Fuck you, bitch! She got me! She threw me the fuck off! How the fuck are you gonna start a conversation like, so you're the girls, right? Fuck you! Who's what? Nope. How convinced were you that that was gonna work? From one to ten? <laughs> like a three? That's more than zero. Fucking bitch! She's gonna win! <laughs> I'm actually pissed! Come on. Oh, fuck you. Bitch. Oh my god. This is a bunch of shit! Oh, I let her win because she was depressed. I let her win because she was sad. I let her win. The house of Chen crumbles at last! Fuck you, Steph. <laughs> fuck you, Steph. Good game. You know my my thank you. <laughs> my girlfriend. You're a much better loser than Gabe. That's no fun. Fucking best friend's name is Steph. Sorry to spoil the victory. Steph, you watch the video. Fuck you too. You're awesome though. You're awesome, bro. You happy? Woo! She's happy again. Or I guess she's neutral. You gonna kiss? Yeah, gonna kiss or what? Maybe not so, now. What are you gonna do now? Dead brother's fucking wake. What do you mean? That shit with Mac. He's clearly lying, right? I need to learn more. I'm not sure what Mac's deal is. His story doesn't add up. Yeah. I do know that I need to find out exactly what happened that night. For myself and for Gabe. I've got your back, no matter what. Thank you. That means a lot. Because I don't I think- I should head back to work. I don't think we heard oh. exactly what happened on the phone. So they could have been having an entirely different conversation. Bye. Hasta luego. Bye. I know Gabe made that call, but did Mac really let the blast go off just to get back at him? Clean your fucking room up. That's the first day of when you're depressed. You need a clean room. You don't need... Don't need clutter. It does... See? I can be a person. It does... Your bed looks like shit, girl. Don't... Oh. Oh, shoo shoo. Hey, shoo shoo. Thanks for sticking around. Girl, you need to get some new clothes. How about that? I'm digging the outfit. I'm not going front. Oh, the wolf looks awesome. This is some, like... I'm kind of feeling... I'm kind of feeling the two wolves. I might get a shirt like that now, man. Wait, so what were we doing again? Feels like a million years since that day with Gabe. It hasn't even been a week. What is the objective? Head downstairs. Oh, shit. Oops. Who the... Now that I'm thinking about it, who the fuck was that chick who messaged us, by the way? Remember Br the, Br the Bridget chick? Because she had been, like, involved? It's a start. Maybe not, but... Come on, what do I? Here it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who is she? Cause we don't know who the fuck she is. Charlotte. Um, Alex, I'm so sorry. You don't have to respond, but I just want to tell you, you were saving Ethan's life. I don't know. Ducky. <laughs> Ducky's a bit weirdo. He's kind of funny. Alex, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have. I don't know how. To, I don't know what to say. Yeah, bro. Yeah, Steph, I'm so sorry I loved Gabe. Only imagine. Alex, I'm so sorry. Let me know if you need me.
Fuck! That's just awkward. Who does puzzle? You have a TV, what are you doing a puzzle? You know what? That's not fair. The other day I did Legos. So long, depression food. I'm clean home, clean mind. Right, Dr. Lin? I'm only cleaning up because... I don't- I actually don't know why. I'm just cleaning up. Um... I don't think there's any else, anything else to clean up. Other than your damn bed! Look at this shit! Let's just go. Let's go. Uh, go- go downstairs. Oh, this is upstairs. Oh. Oh, I'm an idiot. Uh, Alex, I'm having a small evening for you, for your brother tomorrow at 9. I'd love to have you there. Thanks, Jed. Jed's, a, Jed's the homie. Jed is barkeeper homie. Jed, don't turn out to be an evil mastermind or some shit, dude. I, I, don't, think, I don't think he was too old for that shit. Ryan, if you show your ass up, you scare me, dog. Let's fix this chair. Oh, hey, kid, you don't have to do that. Too late. Hmm. Wanted to apologize. For all of us. We're all grieving, but that's no excuse. It was your brother's wake. And you both deserve better than listening to a bunch of fools squabble. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. That was pretty rough. Although it's hard to imagine a good version of your dead brother's wake. No, there's no good version. Just all of us trying to get through it together the best we can. That mustache is amazing. Wasn't the first wake held in this old building. I doubt it'll be the last. Anyway, if there's anything I can do, just let me know. I need to talk to Mac. I know he's lying. I just don't know why. Any idea where I can find him? Well, he helps out Eleanor at the flower shop. That'd be the place to start. Thank Thanks. you. I feel like I should warn you, though. You might not get the kind of closure you're looking for. If you get any at all. Just... Don't pin all your hopes on Mac Loudon. I get it. Thanks for looking out for me, but... What else am I supposed to do? I wish I had an answer for you. But... If you get a chance before you go all dirty hairy... Swing by the dispensary. Charlotte wants to see you. Dispensary? And one more thing. I've been meaning to give you this for the last few days, but I didn't want to disturb you up there. It'll get you through that door and the one upstairs. Thank you, sir. This is your home now. For as long as you'd like. What about rent? <laughs> what about rent? I don't want to be a freeloader. Don't worry about that for right now. We'll work out a way for you to earn your keep when the time comes. Thank you. I would cry right now, dude. I would fucking ball my eyes out. <laughs> Oh, who this be? Who ringing me up? Is it Steph? I, My, oh. I have no idea what to even say to him. Hey, it was terrible. You shouldn't have. I know you're going through a lot, but can we talk? I know. That's going to want, but really, don't talk to you. I, fuck you, nigga. Fuck you. <clears throat> there was a time and place to start that fight, and 
this obviously was not anywhere close to near the time or place. A year ago, I was ready to ditch this place and... Mac Loudon has deleted their comment? What fucking comment did he have to fucking say? You fucking... We have to go beat his ass. Let's go beat his ass. Go find a dispensary. Ryan just running up to us in the fucking middle of the sidewalk. Like, hey, I'm sorry. Your brother, like, listen, bro. You need to chill. I think he just blames himself because he had to cut the rope. But I don't think he had to cut the rope. I feel like he would have been fine if he would have, like, one arm over the other. I mean, that's what I'm thinking. Like, I don't, I, he, I think he definitely could have, like, pulled him up. Okay. Jed said I might find Mac in the flower shop. But I have time to swing by the dispensary if I want. Uh, note to self, Steph. Things to do. What is Wait, where are we doing? All right, note to sell. Notes to sell. Visit stuff in the record store. Visit the dispensary. All right, where the fuck was the? We need a map. Because I don't, I don't know where anything is. Again, this is still a beautiful looking place to live. I would love to be here. The dispensary. Dispensary. What's a dispensary? Oh, right, a weed store. Oh, damn. I'm. Psh. My last video, by the way, got claimed. It's bullshit. Might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Jed said Charlotte wants to talk to me. Charlotte's web? Mm. Do you want to do something together next week? Sure. I have a pottery class Wednesday night. Want to join? Uh, come on, man. Can't you take a hint? She's not into you. Let it go. She's just not into you. Yeah, I usually grab a bite with Katie. You should, if I tell him I like him, we'll date, and then we'll break up, and then I'll lose my best friend. Hmm. Oh. Maybe I could help them. Might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Jed said Charlotte wants to talk. My bad. Yeah, how do yeah, I help him? I usually, if I tell him I like him, we'll date. And then we'll break up. Hear that sound? And then I'll lose my it's fucking control. We hang Come out. On, man, can't you take a hint? She's not into you. Let it go. How do you help people in this situation? What the fuck? You just help random people Guess in the street. Feel like painting the mine. She's just not into Might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Shut up. Jed said Charlotte wants to talk to me. Let me talk to this chick real quick, Riley. If he's innocent, why is he acting like this? Acting like what? Maybe I can get her to tell me. If he's innocent, oh, okay. why She's gonna is keep he saying the same like thing. This? Hey, Riley! Hey. Riles. Alex. The lion. Hey. Roar! Get it? Alex, the lion. Madagascar. Um, Gabe, Eleanor. Okay, let's uh, let's let's just go straight for that it. Fight Mac had with Gabe over your secret meetings. They were about you applying to college, right? Yeah. Ever since the first time Mac lost his shit in front of them, Gabe and Charlotte had tried to get me to end things with him. And after all this, I can see that they were right. Yeah, Mac sucks. You think Mac is telling the truth? Do you think he's telling the truth about the call? That Gabe never made it? No, I... I it's not that... I... Sorry. I'm really not ready to talk about it. Okay. Okay. Gabe. I know you and Gabe were close. How are you doing? I miss him so much. He was 
he's like an older brother to me. You never say that shit to the actual fucking sister of the guy. I'm glad you had him. I'm glad he had you. Um, I'm glad you had him. I'm glad you had him. He was a really good guy, Alex. Eleanor. You and Eleanor seem close. The fuck is Eleanor? She's taken care of me ever since I was little. I never really knew my mom, but she's always been there for me. The old ass lady in the beginning? What does she think about you going away to school? She's thrilled. <laughs> I think she just wants me to end up happy. That's really sweet. We should have eased into it. She's the most selfless it. person I know. She's lucky to have you. Should have eased Thanks. into it instead of me just going straight gunning it with that fucking Mac thing. I want to know about Mac, though. Do you want to talk about Mac? Yeah, I get it. It's just... Uh, why'd you say that? If he didn't do anything wrong... Why is he acting like he has something to hide? Fuck. Is that the right thing to say? He asked me to leave Haven with him. What? what? Right Ooh. after the wake. He wouldn't tell me why. But he just looked so guilty. I told him I had to think about it, but... Alex, I... I'm scared. He did something horrible. Riley. Thank you for telling me. You deserve the truth. Alright. We gonna... We... I gotta run. There's some stuff I need to do. Okay. All right, all right. I have a theory. I have a theory, right? We'll talk soon. Yeah. Whenever you want. I have Mac a trying to skip town is sketchy as shit. I have a theory. I bet I could use that to might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Shut the fuck up, Alex. said Charlotte wants to talk to me. If I tell him I like him. Oh, God. Whatever. Date, and then we'll break up. And I have a theory. Before friend. I go to the shop, let's make my theory. I think that Riley was pregnant with, with um, what's his call's baby, uh, Gabe's baby, right? And I think that he found out because he saw the pregnancy test. But let's just say Mac couldn't have no kids, or she was like, "Well, it's not yours," and he got all pissed. And this was during the same time that we were talking. To get to uh, on the mountain when we're looking for um, Ethan, little dumbass. Might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Alex, shut your ass up. Said and um, maybe, me. maybe he got pissed and was like, you know what? Fuck you. And then he was just like, listen, listen, there's not the time to talk about this, blah, 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 blah. But then he was like, all right, you know what? Fine, I'll tell him to call it off. But he didn't really call it off. That way he can kill not only his sister, but his best friend too. What's his name? Ryan. Or, or one of his close friends, Ryan. Wouldn't that make sense as an evil revenge type shit? Cause that's what I'm thinking that oh, he did. Sorry. What the hell are you? We met briefly. You're Gabe Chen's sister, right? Yes, Alex, Diane. Yeah. I didn't know him well, but I could tell he had a big heart. I'm so sorry for your loss. That is the most company thing to fucking say, bitch. I already know you work for the, um, the motherfucking thing, the mountain mining shit. You fucking bit. It was her. It was her. I bet you she had like, oh, it was a big breakthrough. And then she, and then Mac had the call or he didn't, he was told to ignore the call. Cause there's no way he didn't. Cause he was worried about the little, but he, the, they're both in cahoots. Or Mac is fucking her, you know, there's that. Man, I need some weed. Charlotte? Alex? Hey. Judd said you wanted to see me? 
I just wanted to see how you were doing. I'm okay. Staying busy. Staying busy. I've been trying to stay busy mostly. Saying you're okay is not going to work. My fucking yeah. button is stuck in my pants. Distractions help. How about you? I can't even imagine what you're going through. Honestly, I'm really trying to keep it together for Ethan. He's hurting. Is he all right? He practically just lost a father. But he's shutting me out. He's never done that before. Not when it mattered. He needs time. He needs time. Kids always need time. Oops, Everyone shoot. grieves differently. Maybe he just needs some time. We've been through a lot together. With the divorce and moving. He's never shut down like this. I just can't get through to him. I can't get over the feeling that the one person who could help me deal with the aftermath of Gabe's death is Gabe. What is this? An affidavit from Typhon. If I sign, I'm agreeing not to press charges in exchange for a payment. A big one. How big? How big are we talking? It's send Ethan to college big. Shit. Shit. Are you gonna sign it? I don't know. I'm trying to put Ethan first, but No offense, Ethan ain't what going to college. Do? do you think it would be a betrayal of Gabe? Not really. So, all right. So in situations like this, um, in terms of like a, a company call, a company issue, let's just say like a, um, a guy driving a truck crashes into another person in a normal car and they kill that person. They get off that spouse the money Listen, if you don't sue us, we give you money. But they're like, well, this is, it's not directly the company's fault. It's the driver himself who did it his fault. But then again, you could say it's the company's fault for hiring that driver who fucked up. You see, I don't like making decisions like this. Turn down the offer. I mean, the money is going to a good place. She obviously is going to give the money to uh, to her son. But that bitch did look hella fucking sketchy. Nah, nah, that bitch looked hella sketchy. I'm sorry. I know it's hard, but you can't let Typhon buy you off. Gabe made that call. And I'm going to prove it. I just, I need some time. Thanks for being honest. If she takes the money, it's not even a bad big of a deal either. But I just know for a fact that that bitch is into some shady if they're shit. Willing to pay Charlotte to keep quiet, they're definitely hiding something. Because then they wouldn't feel like they're I saying, really "Don't sue us." By. Feel free to take a look around if you want. All this damn yeah, okay. weed. Come here. Given the circumstances, I could definitely go for a few of these. There's nothing quite like a cup of weed on a cold day. <laughs> Where's weed tea? There's a thing. I know weed butter. My girlfriend's mom actually made some one time. Don't tell the cops. Um, made some one day, and uh, I was. I mean, shit. It's good for you. Weed is. Hey, weed ain't bad. Weed. We live in the world where, you know, we can do a bunch of weird shit, but when it comes to the talk of, like, a drug that is a fucking plant that won't kill you, some, sometimes, 
Um, get over it. It's weed. Shit. Look at Snoop Dogg. He's been smoking that shit for years. I'm a fucking good. Feel he happy as he happy as fuck where he at. Damn. To a fucking webtoon chat. Who looks like let's go see? Still need to check the flower shop for mm -mm. Matt. Flower shop from wait, was I supposed to visit visit Steph in the record store? You look hella bad. Sorry about today. Why should one accident close all the trails? What a wasted vacation. Yes. We're all suffering here. This shot one accident was my brother, you trails punk bitch. For a while. Someone died up in the ravine a few days ago. Uh, well, we can try Steph again. Steph asked me to pop by the record store if I had time. I should one accident. Shut your bitch ass up or I knock your teeth out. Ugly ass bitch. Why should one accident? Oh my god. Fucking Karen looking ass bitch. But your hair ain't real either. Bitch. Steph asked me to swing by. She's gotta be around here somewhere. Hey yo, Steph! Well not one well, Were you sad? Were you happy? Did Chrissy leave me after everything we've been through together. It's hard to beat breakup music. But maybe I can find something around here to cheer him up. <laughs> Fuck. I thought he was happy. <laughs> you said? Why did she leave me? Fuck. Okay, bro. <laughs> it's not my description. Alright. Breakup music. Alright. Let's see if we can help this dude out real quick. Buddy guy. The breakup section, huh? That's rough, buddy. <laughs> Azuka once said, That's rough, buddy. Alright, let's see if we can find him some music to cheer this little fuckboy up. Hmm. How could Chrissy leave me? After everything we've been through together. It's hard to beat breakup music. But maybe I can find some. I can't believe he ordered that record. Fuck. Well, I can't. Apparently, I can't help you, bro. Like, with your fucking. I hope we all get to see more adventures of Thanor. Apparently, hey, stuff I'm is super gay by. for Alex. I've only got a sec, but. Have you talked to Ethan at all? He's taking it really hard. But what you did for me this morning got me thinking. What if Ethan needs something like that too? Something fun and distracting. Something like a LARP. Like costumes, foam swords, that kind of thing? Yeah, but designed just for him and Thanor. It's a good idea. He'll love that. Yeah, I'm glad you think so. That actually sounds funny as hell. I want it to be as yeah, good as it can be. Kinda. Ethan gave you one of his comics, right? Yeah. So, what do you think? Who would the famous monster slayer have the most fun defeating? Kravis, Lord of the Underworld. Storm Rider. The un Storm Rider. Storm Wither or the Undead? Wither. Storm Wither of the Undead. I always wanted to kill a motherfucker who's already dead. Cravius looks pretty badass. Go with that. <laughs> All right then. Oh, I gotta get back in there. Well, There's some stuff in my comp book. Oh. Be cool if you could check it out. Help me make oh. some calls. I'll see what I can do. Fuck you, Cravius, you undead motherfucker. I'ma get you, bitch. Hey, uh, Haven listeners, that was Phone Tap with their new single, Elephant in the Room. We've got a sweet block of indie rock. Helpful. Be back in five or fifteen minutes. Coming down the pike, but first. Wait, what does she want me to do? Steph, fill in oh, no. Steph's comp book. The spring festival is just around the corner. Okay. Oh. Looks like Steph wants me to do more than just make some decisions. She wants me to play a bard. 
guess I'm in. Let's start with my name. Satin Dragon. Satin Dragon. Bring your ex. Sure. Alexandra Alto Alwyn. Alexandra. There's beauty and simplicity. Yeah. Ability time. Oh, yeah. Distortion field sounds fun, but healing serenade could really come in handy. Distortion field. I'm I like healing in Overwatch, so I'm a healer. My friends healing can't relate. Serenade it is. I'll go you. How did I meet Thanor? Heroic story, funny story. Funny story. Let's give it all jokes because kid needs it. A wolf and an ogre walk into a bar. Uh, oh god. Her handwriting is very interesting. This LARP thing just might work. See if we can help this depresso dude. I can't believe he ordered that record. Yeah, I understand. Fuck. I was supposed to help this guy out. I'm gonna have to look up how you help people because I can't. How could Chrissy leave me after everything? The breakup section, huh? That's rough, buddy. I guess you can't, because I, I I don't see a way you can help anyone out. Oh, a cat. Val, oh, fuck you. I just want to be friends. Wait, Chrissy? She's a dog? Are you serious? Wait, Chrissy? Are you kidding? She's a dog? Are you dead ass right now? Wait, 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 hold on, wait, wait, wait. How could Chrissy leave me? After everything we've been through together. Hey. You posted about a lost dog, right? I think they have her over at Todd's Hardware. Are you serious? Uh, thank you so much. I I'll call them right now. Oh my god, my fucking Hi. my hard drive got about full. The lost dog. Chrissy? Is she okay? Oh, thank god. I is she there now? Oh, awesome. Yes. Awesome. Thank you so much. Can I pick her up today? No sweat. Take your time. Looks like oh, the looks like the fat guy from um. Thanks again. Me and Chrissy owe you one. Oh, the fat guy. He looks like uh, remember Jonah Hill's character in um the animated movie Mega Mind. He looks like that guy. I can't remember his name. Steve or some shit. My fucking, my fucking video file got full, so it cut off, right? Luckily, it cut off, like, just perfectly to where I heard it. Because I my, my shit got too full. I have to... Man, my computer is a piece of shit sometimes with memory. Alright, let's go, um... Holy shit, my computer's a piece of shit. Alright, so that happened because I sent something... Oh, stuff. I think Ethan's gonna love it. Yes, he is. Alex, can you convince me to Okay. All right. Well, I'm going to cut right here because I my I have to figure out my fucking video shit. It just cut again. So whatever I have. It's almost an hour. So uh, I'll make the I'll make the next next video like an hour and 10 minutes or I'll, or, or I'll finish the next chapter in the next video. But either way, uh, thank you for stopping by. I do really appreciate it. Hit the like button, subscribe, comment below all that good shit. And I will see you in the next one. Deuces. Shake, shake, shake like a bottle, she popped that, I'm off that Pull up on you with a nerf pack, I bust back I've been feeling bad for the haters Streaming on my music, now they're wanting their funds back Oh my gosh, she on my mind now This song make me wanna wild out Don't act like you too cool to dance now No diamonds, but I'm still gonna bust down You gotta leave those worries on your shelf Whatever happened to being yourself I don't know, but tonight let's lose control Life ain't fun if you're all alone I can get you anything that you want and more I'm a lyrical genius This whole song took 10 minutes to think of Just for you to bump it in them brand new speakers Forget it in a week, where's that brand new single? I got chains like Mr. T.